What's going on, Packers fans? Aaron Nagler here with Cheesehead TV. Well, it's been a year and almost eight months since David Bakhtiari suffered a left knee injury in practice on New Year's Eve day of 2020, tore his ACL, suffered other damage, and missed all of 2021, save for 27 snaps in the season finale in Detroit. Of course, did miss the playoff game and then started on PUP coming into training camp this year after another procedure this offseason. Sure felt like it would be a while until we saw David Bakhtiari on the football field for the regular season. However, Matt LaFleur giving us some good news as Packers fans. With Bakhtiari participating in team drills on Monday after the Labor Day break, Packers are back on the practice field and Bakhtiari is in attendance and participating with the team. This is obviously a huge step for the former All-Pro. He doesn't guarantee that he'll be suiting up and playing in Minnesota week one, but it is good news. Now, of course, making this decision a little bit easier for the Packers is the fact that Yash Nyman played a boatload of snaps for them, 590 to be precise, at left tackle. And while he did allow three sacks throughout the year, overall, he played extremely well. Never really understand why he got sat down for that playoff game. But if they are determined to make sure that Bakhtiari is 1,000% ready to go, They could do a lot worse than having Nyman out there in week one. Now, Elton Jenkins slated to play right tackle. However, he did not seemingly participate in team drills, though reporters are not allowed to watch the team portion. It sure felt like that he would be held out after Matt LaFleur was a bit hesitant in his answer about whether both tackles would participate. The only other person not participating in practice on Monday was Alan Lazard, the only guy on the 53-man roster who was off to the side running with the trainers. He missed last Wednesday's practice as well. So be on the lookout Wednesday when the first injury report gets put out. The Packers do not need to say what's going on with anybody. Until then, hopefully we'll get some more clarity. But there's still, as I like to say, a lot of ball game left as to his participation week one opener in Minnesota. Keep it here for all the latest on the green and gold. And tell your friends and tell your family, Cheesehead TV. We are devoted to Green Bay Packers fans worldwide.